I'm Robert Esther and this is livingpianos.com. This is a wonderful Baldwin model SF10 semi-concert grand seven foot piano. This is an amazing instrument. My father owns a SF10 from a similar era and they're absolutely spectacular pianos. They feature Renner actions like on Hamburg Steinway and Busendorfer, but more than that, it was jointly designed with Baldwin and Beckstein and bridges the gap between the great American pianos and the great European pianos with the clarity and focus you expect out of European instruments, yet with the fatness and the warmth of the American pianos. An absolute top tier seven foot piano. Better than that, these instruments were made at the time when Baldwin was still at the top of their game. This one in 1980. And so the pianos had very light play, and we've gone through it with full regulation and voicing. Looks beautiful. Wait till you hear the tone of this magnificent instrument. I'm going to start with the E minor eight to, uh, prelude, that is, of Chopin, published posthumously after he died. Listen to the singing tone of this instrument. That was a shortened version of this gorgeous nocturne. To show you how it opens up and this thunderous bass out of the semi concert grand, I'm going to play just a little excerpt from the middle section of the Lisp minor sonata. Incidentally, this goes to the lowest A of the piano, so you can really hear what it can do right to the bottom.
It really opens up, doesn't it? And that red interaction is so fluid and precise. I'm going to close now with a little bit of the Pathetic Sonata, the second movement. Listen to the beautiful theme and the singing melody. Notice how it's possible with such a refined piano to play the inner voices so quietly so that the upper melody and bass can sing like a duet. The sign of a truly great piano is almost an infinite range of expression, from the crashing fortissimo, never introducing any harshness, to a singing pianissimo, no matter how quietly you play, to still get a tone that sustains. And this instrument has those qualities. Thanks so much for joining me, Robert Estrin here at livingpianos.com.